Hi guys, hey G Squad, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hello, hi, welcome. Please subscribe and join our happy, happy family. Today is day one of VDEM. VDEM is short for video every day in March. So it made sense to share the most highly requested video. Okay, I know two people asked me, and it's just two, but because I'm a YouTuber, I wanna say, a lot of you guys have requested this. <laughs> Jokes aside, I am going to share business ideas to start while you're a student or working, just do that let's say the same full time, but you can get some extra money from that. And for a lot of them, you actually don't need that much experience, so you can do it. Let's get into it. Yeah. 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 I'm amazing. I mean, I'm the guess what I look All right. The first business, the most obvious one, order things online for other people. I know a lot of people who would love to order things from AliExpress from any website but but people are scared to order for themselves online so you can be the person to order for them charge whatever your markup and they are more than willing to pay for that the next idea is a virtual assistant you could be a page manager for example businesses have social media pages but they don't have time to manage and run the page daily they could hire you they need somebody like you so your job is to respond to messages set appointments that sort of thing you're basically working from your phone the third idea is concierge services let me find the definition of a concierge i hope i'm pronouncing it right it says someone employed by a large company to do jobs such as shopping for employees who are working. So basically what you'd be doing is running errands for people while they work. I'm not sure if there's like a, an agency for that here, but you can freelance, you can do it yourself. You just need to be reliable, you need to be trustworthy. So I'm guessing Korari you start with friends and family before you go on to strangers because we need to be able to trust you with our things i can't send you to do grocery shopping or whatever shopping for me if i don't trust you so you need to be trustworthy for this kind of business what you'd be doing is basically running errands for people who are too busy to do it it doesn't have to be working class hella students there are students who are willing and who are capable who have the financial <laughs> who have the money to pay you who have the money to pay you yeah the fourth service is tuition services you guys are smart i know they were high a lot of high school kids need help with the sciences mathematics paper three commerce anything whatever subject you're really good at you can offer tuition services and the how is it be how is it you can help people because it would be really unfair for you to charge people when you know you can't do a great job and not just for high school kids even in university we need these services so if you're capable if you can make that a business and get some coin out of it you know you're smart you know you study well and you can explain it well to the next person so why don't you do that because we are willing to pay do that do that the fifth skill is to learn an app or master a skill that you already have and then you start charging people for things so they were motivated using the app make thumbnails make channel arts uh design whatever whatever you can design master an app and charge people for the use of that app or a skill i didn't want to say makeup artists and 
hair dressers but basically that's it if you can do hair if you can do braids if you can do french lines master the skill work on it improve and then start charging people for it it's something you really know how to do you just need to practice practice until you're good enough i know we all want money but it's very important to keep improving your work improve your skill so it's worth people's money it's kind of unfair for people to want us to support them only because give us honor support local no we're supposed to buy from you pay for your services because it's actually worth it and you gave us a good product i'm happy with what you delivered you know like it's very unfair for us to support them because support local it's very very unfair the next idea is a fitness instructor you go to the gym all the time you basically know what to do for what you know the works and there are people who will be going to the gym for the first time or actually want to start this fitness journey thing but they don't know where to start they need you to help them and you know what to do while you're helping them you are also doing your thing so it's really a win-win for everybody but you win more because you make money while you do your daily workouts the next idea is to make gift baskets gift or beauty baskets basically you get different products put them together and sell as a package i'll put pictures ideas of what i'm talking about here you can even make it special and take uh items from different entrepreneurs around the city like how people do it for valentine's or for christmas i'll put uh, an inspiration from a valentine's what i'm talking about here yeah, you can put it together and so you know it's cute it's nice it's customized and you can customize it according to your client's needs yeah that's a really great idea that's that's a great idea next idea is to customize things okay so you know how for parties people use red cups or clear cups or whatever yes you can be the middleman between the customer and the printing company so for my 21st epic room, i want these clear cups with my face written horatas 21st instead of me dealing with the printing company directly because i know not all of us want to i wish there was a middleman i could deal with so i don't have to deal with them directly but yeah you become that person i tell you what i want you get it done and we just exchange you deal with the whole you deal with the everything not just cups anything really t-shirts whatever na um presentela the product and i give you the money you get to make whatever markup you would have made from charging me that's your business that's that's a good idea next idea is delivery services you have a car i need a package delivered to somebody but i don't have a car to do that and instead of calling an already established company i could give you the money like that's one thing that's why i always encourage people la how about that airtime buy from that lady sitting in front of the mall under a tree iranza meleko ho yena instead of buying from these big companies your 10 pula your 20 pula makes a difference to a small business person compared to big businesses okay so if you can whenever you can please support small businesses the last one is cleaning and laundry services i've been seeing a trend on facebook i've been seeing a lot of flyers a lot of posts people venturing into that and i love it i love it people will stay alone or banana as friends they would really appreciate somebody to come and clean and do their laundry as a new full time you just pop in on a saturday do their laundry do the cleaning and you get paid it's not a full time thing just a few hours of your saturday or sunday easy that is all i hope these ideas were enough If more ideas come up, I will do 
a part two at a later stage but i hope these were enough and i hope you liked this if you liked this video please give it a thumbs up leave a comment down below and share with your friends see you tomorrow for vdom day two bye the verse of the video is Yeah, too good, nigga. Yeah, yeah, way too good.